Hi guys and welcome back to part 13 of Dishonored walkthrough for the PS3. We've left the distillery district and we're now heading to uh, save Martin um, who is one of the loyalists that's been captured from the overseers. That's the guy there just locked up. I've since come to learn um, that basically the High Overseer is, want, is wanting to kill Captain Kerno and is going to hire someone to poison poison his drink. Um, so I'm taking it that he's going to be there at the meeting and I'll have to save him before he gets poisoned. So just to give you a bit of an update on that guys. Okay, so Campbell plans to poison guard Captain Kerno. A low ranking overseer has been blackmailed him to put in poison at the drinks they are to have after the meeting. Okay, so we need to kill this overseer or we need to speak to Captain Kerno before and uh, advise him of exactly what's going to be happening. I'm hoping later on as the story go goes on, if we save Captain Kerno, he'll sort of join our side with his men that are loyal to him. And we can eventually use them later on um, to get further on and, you know, use them as perhaps reinforcements or, or added troops, you know. See, as I was saying before, guys, I'm wanting to try and knock out as many people, sort of non-lethal blows, as I can. Um, but as you can see there, I'm running out of sleep darts, so it looks like in the future, if I do, if I do come across any guys, I'm going to have to look to uh, to kill them instead. I'm presuming a lot of people who are playing this game have used um, quite a lot of sort of lethal uh, lethal manoeuvres because you do get a lot of ammo, well I say a lot, but there is a lot of ammo to, to come across, um, i.e. sort of bullets, grenades, stuff like that, but I haven't really used any grenades yet. I'm reckoning I probably will have the opportunity to later, um, but I'm at maximum bullets and maximum grenades now. I, just, I, I very rarely use the pistol, to be honest with you. So whether I get to use it later on, whether I'll need to use it later on, I, I have no idea at the moment. Okay, so unfortunately I've timed that horrendously wrong. There's only him on his own though, so should be should be okay. Okay, 
let's have a little look around here. Colonel's visit. Okay, so Captain Colonel and his ret retinue, -y, whatever that word says, will be here this evening. See that they are allowed through the checkpoint without incident. I would like him in a fair mood while when I have drinks with him in the meeting chamber. Also be prepared to defend the checkpoint from the inside should things get awry with negotiations. Not that I expect they should, but I want your overseers prepared in case Colonel and his men live up to the City Watch's reputation. Okay, so they're obviously expecting a bit of a fight, and if some of his men are loyal to him, uh, which which is good, they'll obviously try and uh, try and defend him. It would seem. Just gonna have a look around here, make sure I don't miss anything, any items. Okay, so just a little message there advising that there's different pathways you can take in your mission. You don't have to always go for the obvious. Um, there could be sewers, there could be a higher vantage point, i.e. across the roofs that you could get to. Um, which is good, there's just a few different scenarios which, which I really like about the game. We're in Holger Square now. As it was explaining in that message you saw uh, a couple of seconds ago, obviously this is a different route uh, other than the one you would usually take. So you can you can go for the sewers if you wanted to. <coughs> pickpocket there. It's the first time I've done that in this game. Sort of come up on an away on a way and pickpocket him and give me a hundred coins, which is pretty cool. Um now I've said obviously I'm gonna try not to kill as many people. Unfortunately I've run out of sleep darts, so I'm just going to take him out with a with a bullet, I think. I don't particularly want to go that route yet, so I'm going to see where else you can go. Been spotted. Gonna take these guys down the same way as well. There's no point in being stealthy now that they've been alerted. It's a poor throw.
So I think this building here, this is where the, the high overseer is. It looks some sort of um sort of town hall type building. And obviously the presence of a lot more guards around here would would suggest that. so there's a guard just ahead now I'm going to sort of utilise my dark vision power I don't use that enough I don't think um, should maybe use it a bit more obviously it has the field of vision now as well so it's a very very useful uh, power God knows how he didn't see me there. I'm pretty sure he should have saw me, but we uh, we got away with that one. Okay, so what we're going to do now, guys, is head to the backyard. Um, a different route you can sort of take to, to infiltrate everywhere. And I'll I'll leave it there. Hope you enjoyed part 13. Join us next time for part 14. Thanks for watching.